Let's find out why Haiti, and it was the, the worst quake in around about 200 years, why Haiti was so susceptible. Steph Galt is uh, our meteorologist. You, you've got some ideas of what, uh, what was That's behind right. this. It, the problems are all due to where the Caribbean plate is situated. It's surrounded on three sides by two other plates, by the North American plate and also by the South American plate. Now the problem really is that the North and the South American plate are all trying to move west in relation to the Caribbean plate. So that's the problem. Now there's three different types of earthquake. There's the divergent one where they move apart, the two plates. There's the convergent one where they move together. And there's also the transform one where they just split apart. So they sort of grind together. Now the problem we've got here is in the east of the Caribbean plate, obviously they're moving together. So you'll have convergence. But around Haiti, that's where we have just the transform plate. So these two plates are grinding together. Now often the first earthquake is a pretty bad one. But as we can hear from Amy from the US Geological Survey, it's not not always the only bad one. It can be that typically the foreshock is in fact the, the most dangerous as it may be, in fact the largest in most cases. That's not always the case as some um, aftershocks may in fact be larger than the main shock. In this case all of our aftershocks have been smaller, but you do often have the aftershocks rattling an already weakened infrastructure and creating you know, further instability in the area, which can be more dangerous as people are trying to recover and find safety and shelter. One other thing worth noticing is that the Richter scale isn't really like a normal scale, if you were. Two isn't necessarily twice as bad as number one was. What happens is it's a logarithmical scale. You don't really need to know what that is. All you need to know is that six is ten times worse than five. So for a seven, that's ten times worse than six on the Richter scale. Our aftershocks have been six. That's pretty bad, but it's nowhere near as bad as seven, David.